queen piping. You hear that? There it is. It's either a queen or it's them audibleizing. Sometimes they'll do that. Oh, here we go. Screw this. It might come out, but it might not. Yeah, I want to do it. Y'all got a piece of plywood or something? It's, it's wet on there, man. Ooh. A piece of plywood maybe somewhere? Uh, tarp. It's much more likely. If you have it with a tarp? That's right here. There's something I can stand on where I'm not standing in you know, wet mud. I want to keep my shoes <coughs> pretty. I don't want my feet to get wet. Pretty cool, huh? September 12th, 2015, down in Myrtle Brew, Louisiana. This is a hunting camp and a fishing camp. You see what we got, huh? We're going to give them a better home today. Show you what this looks like. <laughs> wow. It's pretty impressive. Wow. size of this thing folks god bless all right i'm gonna say this thing's probably the size of i don't know like maybe five basketballs it's huge wow look at it look at the sheer size of this thing god bless it's massive
Ooh, man. Wow! That was some high, folks. Let me tell you. Whew. Lots of numbers. Full deep catch box, full medium catch box, okay? Lots of beef. Queen is either in this box or that box. I mean, they were you know, really going to this box because been vacuuming with this one the last hour or so, so they didn't have an opportunity to go with that one. There's some landing on it now. But between the two, we more than likely have her. And I uh, framed up about five frames of brood, and uh, they should be happy and content. And uh, wow, big, big open air colony, folks. I'm gonna approximate the size of this thing is uh, to be about the size of maybe five basketballs. Yeah, biggin', gentle, gentle, gentle bees. I think I got like a couple of stings, and uh, I mean, accidental. They're like little kittens, which is kind of unusual for hive, you know, this big, these kind of numbers, and being an open air colony. All right, uh, and we've had a little front come through. So, hope you all enjoyed the video. Another one from JP the B-Man down in Myrtle Grove, Louisiana. I'm having a good night, and I hope you are too. Until the next one. You should know that compressor's going to go on right now. Doing my sign off. <laughs> oh. All right. There we go. And so... Got the bee set up now, and um, I took the catch box off of the, the brood box, and uh, there were a few bees up there, maybe a couple hundred, if that, and uh, shook them out, and they're running in now. I added a, a medium on top, okay? Got the growing coming up there. Got about five frames of brood here, and I've been open feeding these bees. And, um, and we got uh, the golden rain trees, uh, saw one in my area. That was in uh, pretty much full bloom, so they got that going on right now. And then the uh, goldenrod is going to be coming up uh, probably the next you know, couple of weeks. So anyway, uh, we'll see if we can't get them sitting pretty going into winter. And that's it. Neat. This is the hive that was uh, the big open air colony in uh, Myrtle Grove, Louisiana. Right there. All right, folks, well, that'll do it from Myrtle Grove, Louisiana. Huge open-air colony on the underside of a duck camp. How about that, folks? Hope y'all enjoyed the video. As always, I appreciate y'all out there in YouTube land. Hope y'all are having a fantastic day. I'm going to do my best to have one. We'll see you on the next one. Y'all take care. Bye-bye. <laughs>